the privilege of representing Martin Guitar in various places in the world, and a question that comes up so often is, Diane, what's the difference between the orchestra model and the triple O? Well, usually you hear the answer and it kind of glides over, you may not understand. Here's the, the short answer, it's three things. The pick guard, you'll notice the pick guard on this instrument is what we call a teardrop pick guard. That's what's on the orchestra model. But the orchestra model also has two things, a slightly wider width at the nut, this is the nut of the guitar, and what we call a longer scale length. The bodies of these guitars, the depth and the profile are identical. So the difference is long scale length versus short scale length. Now, how does that translate to the player? Well, I, I was grateful to have Dick Boak give me a great way to, to explain this to you. If I wanted to make the orchestra model be just like the triple O in terms of the scale length, I could put a capo here, and then they would be equal scale length. However, if I do that, then this is gonna be a half a step higher in tone. So to make them equivalent, I'd have to tune this down, okay? And then it would become a triple O. Well, if I loosen these strings, this would be kind of loose. Well, guess what? That means it'd be easy to bend. That's why triple O's are favored by blues players like Eric Clapton, because you can bend them. Whereas the orchestra model, with that longer scale length, it's a little bit tighter and louder and more brilliant. Hence, someone like John Mayer loves the orchestra model. That's the difference, and if you want to impress your friends from across the room, remember, you can pick out the orchestra model from the teardrop pick -up.